Hey, what's going on guys? This is the Hyper Tough 12 volt cordless ratchet. And I, I posted a review video about this and I noticed in the comment section, people were saying that you can use this manually. And I'll be honest, I did not know that. So as you can see right here, this is the test we did where we were trying to break this uh, bolt loose. And as you can see, it does not have the torque to do it. All right, so I'm, I'm gonna try to manually break this free. Let me try it on this one. Let me make sure I got it in the loosening position. All right, so as you can see, you can hear it ratcheting. Okay, so I'm gonna try to break this loose manually. Use it like a ratchet now. Manually tighten it back down. <sighs> yeah, and it got it pretty tight on its own. I didn't really have to do too much ratcheting that time. But yeah, my question really is, uh, what's the breaking point for this tool? How much force can you put on it before it starts snapping the uh, plastics and the insides? I'm not really sure how how long or how far down this bar goes. This is uh, the strongest point of the tool. So I'm not sure if it runs through the entire inside. Again, this is the HyperTuff 12 volt cordless ratchet uh, on sale for $40 at Walmart. Comes with a two year warranty. All right guys, um, I really wanna put this thing to the test. This is the part of the video where I'm gonna ask you to please smash that like button just in case I break this. I wanna say if, if you're in a pinch and you don't have a four way to take your tire off, as you can see, way too much torque for this. I did it. All right, we got it loose. There we go. So I guess um, I probably wouldn't be too worried about, you know, putting an extreme amount of force on this. All right, so that's uh, pretty much the limits of this tool. I appreciate you checking out the video, and I'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching.